Good morning. So I wanted to hit on rising to the occasion this morning. And, you know, a lot of us talk about failures and things in our life that we weren't able to do before. Or I tried that, or I tried this, and I did that. And sometimes we need to look at ourselves because we get caught up in the past and we let it haunt us and we let it take over and it paralyzes us. And life is hard. Life's always gonna be hard. It's the hard to get you the growth. It's the hard that matures you. You're gonna go through pain. That's where strength comes from. Don't run from that. Embrace that. <coughs> Understand you need that to grow. And for a while there, years ago, I struggled with that. And gratefully, <coughs> I'm sorry, <coughs> choking on something. Gratefully, I had some really great friends and people that would pull me through in those moments sometimes. But more importantly, I had me. I pulled myself through. You need to be your own best friend. You need to be able to snap out of what your problems are. We need to stop being victims and be overcomers. We need to tell ourselves we are enough and I'm not gonna let what happened to me in the past affect where I'm going. And you need to love yourself and forgive yourself. Take whatever's going on in your mind, analyze it, forgive and let go and move on. You have to, you need to do those things. That's how we grow. That's how we make changes. If we're complaining about where we currently are in life, I want you to look at the habits that are in your life. What do they look like for you? I have 40 years of habits. Some are great, some are not. But I am where I am because of those habits. So if I wanna create a different result, I need to change some of those habits. Definition of insanity, doing the same thing over and over and expecting different results. You're not going to. You need to make changes. I'm not saying you have to do these humongous changes, but being better every day, doing something to improve to where you want to go. And a lot of us are taught, you go to school, you get a good job, and that defines what you have. Change that thought. Define what it is you want and go after it. Come up with a plan and, and go after it. That will give you what you want. So I'm not saying wrong or right, but if you are a dreamer and you're dreaming big and you're chasing goals, I'm getting up at five o'clock in the morning and I hate the morning time. But I have made changes because of what the results I want to achieve. I need me time. I need to take some time for me before these kids get up in the morning and they're hard to get up. But I decided I'm gonna, I'm gonna have my regiment in the morning and I'm gonna stick to it. Because I need that for me. What do you need for you? What changes are you gonna make? If you're not happy with where you are, people, places, and things, think about it. Do you have someone that's lifting you up or pulling you down? Are you telling yourself, I'm enough? Are you your own best friend? Or are you being your worst enemy? What are you telling yourself? So things to think about today, and I just wanna encourage you, you know, wake up smiling, wake up happy, get up and get dressed. I'm not leaving my house today, but I got up and I got dressed because it changes you. It motivates you. Motivate yourself, 